A circle has this equation. The circle touches each side of a square as shown. Work out the total shaded area, giving your answer to three significant figures. So the first thing we need to do is identify the equation of a circle. So always remember it's in the form of x minus a all squared plus y minus b all squared and that equals r squared, where your center equals a, b and your radius equals r. So in this case, we can state that our radius is just a square root of 96, which you can write as a square root of 60 times the square of 6 which is just 4 root 6. What we need to do firstly is identify the area of our square so we'll need the length of our square. If our radius is 4 root 6 the diameter is 2 lots of our radius so 2 times 4 root 6 and that gives us 8 root 6 and we know the area of a square I'm just going to write a square equals your length times your width so in that case it's 8 root 6 times 8 root 6 which is the same as 64 times 6 and that gives you 300 184 units squared and then to obtain the area of a circle we know the area of a circle is simply pi r squared we know what r squared is r squared is 96 so that's the same as 96 pi therefore the shaded area would just equal the difference between the area of the square and area of the circle so it'll be 384 minus 96 pi and when you put that in your calculator that gives you 82.4 units squared to three significant figures so your final answer is 82.4 units squared.